Okay, here we are. Dodge Ram. Actually, we don't call it Dodge. Ram. Mega Cab. 3500. Laramie. Hit a Chupacabra right here. But anyway, here's what we're talking about. The leak. Who has a leaky truck? Here's the fix. Bucket. But look, in this angle, it's not leaking from here. See? The 2006 is leaking from here. On the street, we try to clean this little drain hole down here. See right there? That's where the drain hole is. Some other character told me that. We put a vacuum on that. Vacuum pump. Thought it sounded clean. It made a suction noise. Seemed about like it was working. But uh, no wetness right up in here. No drip here at this angle. But here's the fun stuff. Everything in the back was wet and moldy. Do you like that? You can sleep back here. Isn't that cool? So here's what we're doing now. Pushing towels here because super wet. I'm pulling a soggy towel out every day. But just thought I'd get to this picture since it's leaking like hell right now. Look at that, all the moisture here. And then look up here. Can you see that? Headliner's wet. Luckily no stains yet. How's oh, the water coming back? A little stain up here. Look at this back corner is all wet right in here. Right there, all wet. <laughs> what a pile. <laughs> Come on, Ram. Step it up. What the hell? It's a 2014, so there's a little drain. A little drain drip there. See it? Right there. Oh look. Ha! You see that? Just dripped right there. Right from that corner. What's up with that, huh? Dripping right down there. Thank you, Ram. Appreciate it. All my crap was wet. Good excuse to clean the truck out. Look at all that moisture there. All right, case of beer to the guy that uh, helps me figure this out. The one guy said it's this little spring guy up in here. Here, let's check it out. I don't think we can see it unless we open the roof. We could open the roof. It's not raining right now. All right, let's check this out. Let's see what you guys think. Look at that, turned it on, opened the roof, and he ran in. Turn it on some more. Don't need a key. Oh, <laughs> pushing the wrong button. All right, so anyway, let's see if our drain hole's got any junk in it. Eh. Almost need the ladder. Oh, okay, look at that. Our gutter doesn't have water, okay. So our gutter did have water right down in here, right? We did have a puddle of water, but we sucked the hole. Oh, look, dry here, see? Dry there, dry over here. Now he said it was this little spring guy right here. Defect on the ramp, should be a recall. This spring, this floppy guy, air dam. So this spring here, he said that hole right there, he pulled down the damn headliner and put silicone caulking underneath, really. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Pull down the damn headline? Are you kidding me? I don't know how to do that. So anyway, hmm. is there a gutter in the back? So there's back drain holes, but they said they come out way back here. Can you see back there? I can't see back there. I could pull off the back panels. The guy with the YouTube video who talked about uh, the drain holes. Yeah, showed me the picture where the drain holes are. On our other Mega Cab, we can see the drain holes better. Um, we could pull off this back panel. That doesn't look as nasty as the ceiling. And then we could see the tubes get to the drain holes. Pull this panel off. How involved is that, huh? All right, let's check out this other rig. We'll empty a bucket because you think that'll be fun. I know it will be. 1500 Hammy. That's right. Mega cab. Hell yeah. Mickey. Mega cab. See how much water's in this. Whoops. 
And this baby. Leaky trucks, Ram. What's up with that, huh? If it wasn't for your Cummins and your Mega Cab, I would have tossed you a long time ago. Look at the drip. See that? Door handle. The other one leaks from the door handle uh, if it's pointed downhill. So maybe it's the... We haven't got the rear gutter drain holes yet. On this truck, we haven't got the rear gutter drain holes yet either. But the cool guy on uh, YouTube... We were looking all underneath the truck for a drain hole. Check this out. Right there, see that? Same as the other truck, right there. A Little bit of mud came out, but still didn't fix it. We should put a suction on it, but hey. We emptied this this morning from last night's rain, an inch of rain. We had a yeah, three quarter gallon. For about every inch, we get a gallon, see? Yeah. Got the bucket in both fancy trucks. All right, any tips, let me know, a case of beer to the person who helps figure this out for me. Thank you much, bye-bye.